be able to steal it away unless Snake oh. can stop him at the last second, and he does. It's an all-out brawl with Bolts doing some serious work. It's Bolo above to save the round for his team. Explosion goes off, Fultz on the case, Bolo knows it. He's got the dirty dozen and he'll break lucky number 13 with that kill. And no matter, Gridlock has some major advantage, Bolo, good lord. Goes for a jump out, gets two picks, P for Gunner. And well, could this be it for Mark? Yes, it is, and a grave for him, but it comes with 20 seconds left. Bolo, a huge round, he gets the final two kills. TSM are storming through this matchup. They're up five to nothing. They're known uh, when they first joined the NAL as a cafe team. They are such a formidable team on that specific map. Is there anything interesting that you saw, albeit briefly? Oh, Bolo did the thing. He did the, the he mouse. Did the, oh, oh, he did the thing again. again. Hold on, third. Come on. Come on, do it. Ah. Oh. Coward. Third will now throw it again, and an E1D will keep Rexen from being able to get the Selma charges. It costs him the security of the position he was in. Bolo's in the middle of the uh, site. What? He takes some damage, he gets a kill, and now he's planting. What? There's no cover. There's absolutely nobody watching this. And TSM are in excellent position. Sonic's now have to scramble to get back into the bomb site. Bolo just rushed on in. Gunner punishes him for it. But now back onto the diffuser he goes, looking to pick up cans in, but it's achieved with the two-piece to close out the match. Just here as the shield has been cleared off from in front of him. Bolo opens things up with a nade onto Palu. It's all starting to fall apart. There's Team Liquid struggling here on the top floor. That's going to be PSK gone. Mez cleared out. And now Nesk is in a perilous position, doing what Nesk does best. He gets aggressive. He goes forward and he finds himself one. Can't find two as he runs Honestly. into Bolo, who is just absolutely red hot right now and cannot be stopped. But it's looking dicey. Ask under a lot of hot pressure. Another four versus one for TSM. And Guess who's left alive? It's reset it's for them. Palu gets one, and he nearly gets two with Gio being downed above, but they're just fighting hard to keep him alive, and they will be able to. Merc goes in and makes a great challenge there onto Palu, who is just low on ammo, and it's all up to reset some PSK now. What can he do in this position as well? Resets. I think he must have to have an impact left. Yes, he does. Can burn through it, assuming there is no ADS. You heard it go off there, but Bolo looks on the downstairs and finds the kill. So no, maybe it didn't go off. It was just a concussion. Oh, Bolo with the last two kills to come through. You're and a much better round from TSM with three left alive at the end. Was lobby is daring someone to come for the swing. If he shuts down Pamba here, it could be massive for them. You've also got the sledge above. Almost finds a kill there. In fact, will find it. Can he get the second? Yes, he can. That is one way to shut down the pressure coming in from the attackers. And with that move itself, he may have just won the round for TSM. Oh, it's just too good. It should not be allowed. Fans is the doesn't move Honestly. his feet out of bathroom. Absolutely unreal. May just hinder his ability to deny a plant here. Merc tries to find one, but Pamba manages to cut him down. Immediate trade comes in. Geo's getting the plant down. There's somehow TSM have been able to steal inside a site and May just steal the round here. Bolo knows there's a challenge to be found and boy does he find it. Three on the round for him. Going absolutely wild taking hyper down cuts wow. eclipse as well 4k for bolo easy for tsm east wall was breached oh and we my were barely into the round charlotte bolo fine kills furia they've lost the head there's it's falling apart they just can't do anything right at this wow, point miracle five, yeah. taking a different challenge a difficult challenge with an smg you can't keep feeding Bolo on the rappel like that. He's going to have to swing with the shotgun. And there are two of them, three of them watching. They're ready. They get the shuts out. TSM up to match and series point. Not a line that I thought I would have said. And it will still put TSM into a bit of a corner. Swaylen and Bolo both get one down the staircase. Two for Swaylen. Bolo needs to find one more, but it oh! might be in the lion dance. Oh my god. The headshot magically through the wall. Bolo saves it from certain defeat, and TSM are up with three rounds. The main wall reinforced. He could hold here for a little bit longer, and his job isn't trying Ooh. to deny a little bit later. He finally will get taken down with one Toxic Babe left in his pocket. Open area, so still, it's achieved, and it's Bolo who are up top, uh, right above the site, but it's a very quick rotate back through. Parabellum is seeing if they can't take some people off the board, but Melted is the first casualty. Bolo still inside Teller's office, looking to steal off somebody here from ATMs. Bolo continuing his kind of wrath from the previous Ooh. series. He's going to be able to follow that through already with a double inside of the first round of the series. Kool-Aid will get the first exchange here for Parabellum, but he himself will be re-exchanged pretty much immediately by Bolo, who's up to a triple already single-handedly taking care of all this aggression from Parabellum right now. What well, let's make it four, because why the heck not? Bolo just ripping everyone to shreds on PB right now. Took down a second member of Parabellum, and a Nitro there has downed Penguin, although he's possible to get revived in a second here once 
once that smoke fades away. Melting can creep right over fourth, but they're very quickly running out of players to assist in this nature. Bolo gets a second one now against Eska. Might as well take the fight outside the map if you don't think you're able to do it inside the map very effectively. And TSM really take it to task. Parabellum only left up is now melted. He doesn't even have Diffuser. He's probably just going to go from a frag or two if he can nail it. But he already knows there's not really much that he can do about it. Bolo looking like he's getting back into the game. And so is TSM collectively here. You're still good. That smoke, that smoke. Nice. Alright. I can't see shit. We got it, we got it, guys. Oh, we're good, we're good. I hear rotate, watch hall. <laughs> Look at that, guys! <laughs> you don't hear it get brought up all that often. The clock is just continuing to work against them. And now it's Grizzly under fire from multiple angles. Bolo, long range, subdues him. Benja's in a frost map. Things have gone from bad to worse. And oh my! The stab of your fingers! Two bear mat kills. TSM win their very first round. TSM is such a healthy cushion too. Even if this round is chucked for some silly reasons, it's not gonna be too much of a lost round overall for TSM here. They are not secured into the playoffs as of yet. They do need to keep their round differential in a very healthy place in the event of any tiebreaker between them and a second place team in this group. And there oh. we go, Bolo locking it out with the two final kills and giving us a very quick GG in the favor of TSM. Gunfire being exchanged and TSM trading out a lot of HP. Bolo with three kills, five and one so far. Drones go in. Oh, Bolo walks no, he gets up. both. <laughs> Just Bolo things. This is a full friend, full frontal assault right now. Two for Merc, two for Bolo. We're 90 seconds in, and it's Gunner in a 1v5. We've yet to see a flawless round between these two teams, but we'll see one there. Three kills for Bolo, TSM up 2-0. On the back end, Static takes the head off for Gasher and realizes, well, they're both up here. Let's go down there. Bolo, in the meantime, is doing Bolo things. Inside construction, one more on the clock and the lock. The pings are coming towards the player. The roll of the exo... Uh, well, Bolo getting a quad kill in the meantime. I was going to say the roll of that causes a bit of a fight, but it's suddenly a one versus one out of nowhere. No info here from Heroic. He might just get a kill or two for how, how how is he being able to find all this ground? He's going through, and he gets it. He finds Uno. Oh, the right way. What? Flicks down onto Benja. Dan's already retrieved it, and he's going to go for the first real planet tip. Here comes Bolo on the lurk up through the wood stairs, though. He catches always. He's going to try to stop the plant, but no. Dan's got it in a safe position. He's going to lock it down. Nearly kills Bolo, but Bolo oh! still causing problems from upstairs here. He gets the third kill. Scyther's the only one left here, but he's got a frag to bring out as well. Manages to take down Shala. Two more still to go. He's found the second one. Both players now off the counter to fuse, but Achieve will shut him down, knock out Scyther, and give us another round for TSM. Extremely similar, all the way down to Merc having Vigil as well. But as we all know, folks, if you played enough Siege, you know that a lot of strategies work. Oh my god! Dan, he gets blown sky high by a Nitro. Scyther in desperation! Another one! And suddenly it's a 5v2. TSM are in full control of this series, and they've only got two more bodies to find. The smoke of Shepard is down below. Joystick, where does he sit? That's the question. Watching for a repel, potentially for one on the roof. He could engage, but he gets smoked by Achieved. It's a 5v1. If there's ever been the time for a flawless round, it's now. Everything on the line for TSM. What a year it's been from them. And it's all now Shepard to try and stop it. Empire have come so close before, but they've fallen short and they'll do so again. TSM said, trust the process. The process just won you a world championship. TSM are your sixth invitational 2022 world champs.
Congratulations to TSM. They are your six Invitational 2022 champions. NA lifts its third hammer over the course of the Invitational. Six events we've had, half of them belong to North America. And this one is for TSM. People doubted them the entire year. They've had a rough time. They showed up last SI, the last hope of North America at SI 21. Well, they came back the next year and they took it all home. Save it in, boys. Deserve every bit of it.